In West Bengal Shamsher Ganj the Ganga's changing course is rapidly altering lives and landscapes On July 29 2024 the river's banks suddenly gave way claiming at least 10 houses and displacing over 60 people giving residents no time to react They ran out and watched as their homes slid slowly into the churning waters below The incident was not new. Over the decades, the riverbank has broken away in bits and pieces, taking huts and belongings with it, a pattern of destruction that has intensified since 2020. Residents recall instances when over 100 homes were lost in a single day. The affected area spans 18 kilometers in and around Shamsher Ganj a small assembly constituency that falls in Bengal's Murshidabad district it is home to a largely indigent population many of its residents work in the bd industry earning a meager rupees 178 for every 1000 bds they roll for them the loss of homes is a devastation that pushes them further into poverty homes often represent their life savings or are built on loans they are struggling to repay we are at notun shipur village on the banks of the ganga on 29th july river bank erosion cost around 50 families of their home in fact for the past 4 years shamsher ganj particularly the regions under the gram panchayats of notun shipur protap ganj and nimtita have been living in fear of river bank erosion amno dekhe chilam ke na dekhchi ta bhavta mat na ghurche ghurche ta khubi ke na to dekhche re bostate dale jal bhore dile ta ami bari loke dakchi ki tarte jay tere jol kemon korche je to bari elam bari eshe sob ber korte lalam bari ber korte ber korte korte sob gore galo the impact of the july 29 erosion was swift and severe In Natun Shipur village many people barely managed to snatch a few essential goods sometimes a bed sometimes a trunk before the house is crumbled and fell Kichu bacheni maun legeche je taratari kore chhele niye ma ke niye taratari beriyechi ghor theke ar dhose chole gelo ek ta ek theke abar onno lok lagge ei to ghor meje chheler tala tola bhanglam chhele chilo na sob ber korlam ber korte korte to tar ekta ghor chole gelo pol pa bathroom sob pore gelo আসে <laughs> Hearing that their homes might be next, some villagers have now begun to dismantle their homes in advance. Others are rummaging through whatever the river has left behind. People painstakingly pick up the bricks first. Bricks cost rupees 10,500 per thousand pieces. They hope to use the salvaged bricks whenever they find a place to rebuild their lives. The government response has been limited. Many displaced residents reported receiving no money and often not even a temporary shelter. They stayed with neighbors or camped in the nearby mango and lychee orchards. Kono byabostha kichu nei keu sahajjo korte asena bhote somoy bhor dao bhor dao bhor dao ekhon kono asena. Ekhon amader kono sare koruk sahajjo koruk ei din rat khali chobi tuli jacche amra more jacchi na khe khe chobi tuli dile ki hobe. রাস্তায় বসে আছি এখন পর্যন্ত আমাদের কোনো থাকার ব্যবস্থা হয়নি বাচ্চা কি খাচ্ছে বাচ্চা কি খাচ্ছে বাচ্চাকে মুড়ি খাওয়াচ্ছি বিস্কুট খাওয়াচ্ছি এই ভাঙনটা গত 4 বছর ধরে চলছে গত 4 বছর ধরে অনেক সাংবাদিক আসছে অনেক কিছু আসছে প্রশাসন আসছে ভিডিও আসছে কিন্তু কোনো এখনো অবধি আমরা কোনো সুরাহ পাইনি এবারেও কয়েকদিন আগে নদী ভেঙেছে আমার বাড়ি ভাঙলো দেখতে পাচ্ছেন This area is rich in fruit trees, but in the last five years, hundreds of orchards and farmlands have been claimed by the Ganga 
as it changes its course capriciously. In fact, the situation extends beyond Shamshir Ganj. Across the Ganges Brahmaputra Delta, including in parts of Bangladesh and the Sindhabans, river and sea erosion regularly changes the local geography, making and breaking islands and banks at will. Climate change has exacerbated this natural course of events. The Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change reports that sea levels in the Bay of Bengal are rising by 4.4 mm annually, which is 30% higher than the global average of 3.4 mm per year. This has contributed to more frequent flooding and accelerated erosion of banks. The directly affected houses, uh, is, it is about uh, near about 200 plus. Okay. Uh, and, and those the affected family, it is near about 400 to 500 maybe. Okay. The scale of land loss is significant. Landowners speak of losing hundreds of acres. Many once prosperous landowners are left with only their houses. One resident, Abdul Razak, lost 26 bigas, approximately 16 acres, of land to river erosion between 2020 and 2024. <laughs> না বালি তো কোনো কাজ হচ্ছে না গত 2020 সাল থেকে এই যে বস্তা ফেলছে মাঝে মধ্যে যখন নদী ভাঙনটা খুব জোর হচ্ছে তখন ওই কিছু কিছু বস্তা দুই চার নৌকা ফেললে দুই চার দিন ফেললে ফেলার পরে আবার এই এক বছর গত এক বছরে নদী ভাঙন নাই তারপরে কোনো নেতা মন্ত্রীর কোনো দেখা নাই কিছু নাই এক্সপার্টস এক্সপ্লেইন দ্যাট দ্য গঙ্গাস মুভমেন্ট উইদিন इट्स মিয়ান্ডার বেল্ট is a natural process. However, unplanned development near the riverbanks, particularly following the large-scale migration after partition, has worsened the human impact. Residents complain that the sandbags the government has used to shore up the banks have proven ineffectual. They suggest using boulders instead. <laughs> In the instance of the Mississippi River in the US, which used to frequently change course and erode its banks, concrete revetments have been used with success. The West Bengal government should ideally find a long-term plan for river erosion to help such communities whose already precarious lives are further endangered by nature. In Samsung block last two or three years before, we have uh, given 140 pattas uh, one time Secondly, I have given 78 pattas and lastly, I have given 16 pattas to these affected peoples. The story of Shamshar Ganj is not just about a river changing course. It is also about how large sections of the population fall beyond the administration's interest and reach. And about how unprepared India is to deal with the many manifestations of climate change.